Hi, I'm Jill Van Duestein. I'm the commercial program manager for Willow Glass. And what we have here is our uh, initial showing of our branded product, which is 0.1 millimeters thick or 100 microns thick. It's a meter wide. And when we ship this commercially, we'll have a minimum of 300 meters on the roll. Um, you can see that it's uh, pristine. Uh, it's made by Fusion Process, which is the process we use to make uh, both Eagle XG, Gorilla Glass, and our Lotus Glass. So it delivers extremely high uniformity, um, extremely high surface quality, and it's a very uh, reliable, high performance glass for electronic substrate applications. Okay. Now, obviously, you, you must have concerns about handling for a world roll process because of the fragility of the glass. How are you? How are you dealing with that? Well, we um, have a couple of product design concepts that we're working on. One is edge tabs. So we put a, um, you can see it best on this roll, I think, here. So this roll has um, a polyamide tape on the edges of the glass, and that provides a number of benefits. One is that um, you can steer the web by the tape um, rather than trying to touch the glass. It keeps the glass from touching the rollers where it can pick up a scratch. And if there is a break in the glass, the tape maintains the integrity of the web. So you don't have a, cat a catastrophe, you basically have a, a, a yield event. Um, so this is a, a means that we have for enabling roll-to-roll -roll processing on flexible glass. I, I can see how that could work on for uh, small width rolls, but if you go to a larger width roll, the sag, I think, wouldn't, wouldn't that be a problem for touching the roller in the middle of a, a large roll? So we're still exploring um, how to scale up, um, but for the widths we see here, one third meter, one half meter, we think that should, which should work. Okay. And, and this glass over here was coated with ITO in a roll-to-roll -roll process at um, Binghamton University's CAM Center, and it was done on a tool that was designed to do ITO on polymer films in a roll-to-roll -roll process. And with a few minor engineering modifications, it was able to run the glass. Um, so we see that as a real um, breakthrough in terms of a demonstration of what can be done with a flexible glass. Okay. Thanks very much. Thank you.